guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be showing you guys what I got from Shein. Shein. I spent about $80 there and I've never ordered from there. I have ordered from Zaffle and I was actually happy with their products because it was just like swimsuit material, so I was good with that. Some advice I would have for you is that if you're gonna make a large order or a large purchase, buy a gift card because you are gonna be saving money if you buy a gift card. For example, you can get an $80 gift card for $75 or it can go up to an $800 gift card for only $650. $50, I think so you'll save $150 but that's for like huge purchases I wasn't aware of that at first but I just wanted to let you guys know in my order I got a lot of sets and swimsuits because I think that you can get more for your money I'll do the swimsuits last but I'm gonna try these on for you guys a little bit later too so let's just get started all here are all the clothes I bought all of these come individually wrapped in these little like Ziploc bags. So this is the first item. I think this one is a set straight off the bat, a little bit see-through. But that just might be because I'm right in front of the light. This one is just a skirt. Okay, confusing at first. This is a little polka dot skirt. It's really cute. I think I only paid like $7 for this. I'm glad that in the back it has this stretchy elastic. It also has a zipper on the side for you to put it on. Or it's just going to go in front so you can tie it. I'll put sizes and the pictures on the screen somewhere. I think most of the things I got were an extra small. Here is the matching top also. It'll look better. It's all put together. I'm scared that's going to be a little bit see-through though. This is really cute because of the sleeve. That's the first set that I got. Here's what this looks like. It looks cute and all, but it is pretty thin. I do need to get out all of these wrinkles, but it is thin. You can see that it's thin. As you can see my bra, so I'm gonna have to like fix that somehow. Overall, it's pretty cute. The shoulders kind of seem like a bit much. You can always just wear this without like this whole situation. Maybe just like jeans, high-waisted jeans or something. Bows seem a little bit much. But again, these come in a lot of different colors, so you can go ahead and go and see if you would like this style in any other color. The second item that I got was this plaid skirt with buttons on the side. This size is an extra small. I'm hoping that this is going to fit me. And they give you an extra button just in case. You can also zip it up on the side. For the most part, this one is actually pretty good quality, and since there are two pieces of fabric right here, it's not as see-through through the front. I think this one's pretty decent, though. It also came with this off-the-shoulder ruche top. It also has elastic on the shoulder, so it'll be stretchable. This one is actually pretty good quality because it's black, it's not as see-through. And you can use this to match with a lot of other outfits. You don't have to just wear it with this. This one seems pretty solid because it's not see-through or anything. I couldn't tell which one was the front or the back for this top, honestly. But it's pretty nice, it's pretty secure, and if you put your hands up, it'll kind of just go back to the same place. This one's really cute, and you could wear the top for other outfits. This was also an extra small, so what I'm noticing is that if you're smaller than me, which I have like about a 26 inch waist, 36 inch hip, whatever. I'm like 5'3", about 120 pounds. If you're smaller than me, I'm not sure if any of these pieces are going to fit because they might be too big because these honestly fit like perfectly on me. So I would really recommend this one. Next one that I got is a top. This one was on sale, so I was just like, why not get it? It is this cherry print little. I so thought it would be kind of cute to wear. This isn't, these aren't even cherry. Okay, I guess there are lemons on here. I really don't know. This is really cute. I like the little ruffles at the top and it scrunches stretchy so it'll be comfortable as well first thing i noticed though is that this is really thin maybe it's because i'm sitting down i don't know but i thought this would be a little bit shorter like more a more of a crop top an issue with this might have to be the ruffles might like be all up in your armpits and it might be uncomfortable and the straps are also not adjustable so there's like tiny little lemons i guess on here this one as expected it is a little bit longer than i thought it would be it's kind of childish honestly for my life Liking. It's still pretty cute, but also as I said, it is like going up my armpit. I'm kind of not really comfortable. I don't know. I feel like I'm just like wearing a big tutu. Not so sure about this one. It's a weird feeling when it's all the way up here and you can't adjust the strap. This can be cute. I like the cut of it and the ruffles here up at the top and how it's form-fitting, but maybe in a different pattern I would like this. It's just literally tickling my arms. So this is natural for the shirts too, but if I lift my arms and then rest them, it'll kind of like bunch up like that so you're gonna have to keep on pulling it down i just wish they might have done something about this 
whole armpit situation next one is also another plaid set i opened this one up before here is the top this does have adjustable straps but so this is just plain black and white they have a lot of other colors too i think they have like pink as well i don't think that the v cut is low enough to like be showing your bra so you can't wear a bra with this i hope so the band seems kind of big a little bit it's a little bit stretchy this one is really small so we're gonna have to see how this works and it also came with this skirt this this is a little bit see-through. It also has a little cute cut on the side right over here. This also has a stretchy elastic waistband. This is also a longer skirt, so you can wear this more high-waisted, which will balance out the short top. This one was only like $8, which is pretty good because that's only $4 a piece, basically. <sighs> For this one, I feel super like naked in and exposed i feel like this is very sheer and like it could easily ride up because it's also thin and honestly not much coverage on here you could also see my bra a little bit so you're gonna have to get a really like v-cut bra fabric kind of scrunches up here maybe you could just pull it up <sighs> it's cute and all i just don't know if i would wear this i don't know what to do about this bra situation this one i would also wear a different top I just wouldn't wear these together because I feel way too exposed. This one does run on the thinner side though, so watch it for this one. It also, I feel like it makes your boobs look a little weird because this is supposed to sit lower. <sighs> it's pretty cute though. I'm just not sure if I wear this. And then I also got another set. This one is a tube top and shorts. It's just a plain black tube top. It's kind of like knit. It's nice and stretchy. Only downside is that it looks really small. Like literally, this is only like a bra. But I mean, that's the style. So the size is also an extra small. So again, like the other top, you can just use this for other outfits as well. That's why I also like getting the sets. And then here are the shorts. Really see-through from here. But they're really nice and flowy the reason why i see it as see-through is because i can see it through the led light that's coming at me so if i were to shine my flashlight through it i think you guys would okay well you can see my flashlight so that kind of just like shows you how sheer it kind of is but the plus side is that it's like really flowy and would be really nice and airy for the summertime if it's really hot this is really cute it just has just a bunch of flowers on it it also has the little parts where you can weave through your little belt thing and then also tie this in a little bow on the side this one's actually really cute it's also high-waisted so it would also balance out the really small tube top so far nothing has been like way off because some of these like cheap websites can be really misleading but i think overall for the price that i'm paying for most of these pieces it's pretty good it's a pretty good deal this one is actually really not that bad because of the elastic waistband it's actually more form-fitting than a lot of the other ones like the previous one i just wore the one that was scrunching up like way too much over here that's because it's not tight enough this one's pretty good really easy to wear and it's really comfortable super flowy but not too flowy rid of this being too long because this is so short um having it higher is a lot better for me personally this is a nice fit the next item is one of the more expensive pieces that i purchased this one is just a dress a lot of these pieces do come in different colors so if you like the style of any of the pieces that i'm showing you you can always just go check on sheen and see if they have a different color that you prefer here is the dress that i purchased they have a lot of styles where you can tie it yourself and put a bow on the side this is kind of similar to one of the other pieces that i showed i like the color in the back it also has a stretchy waistband and also a zipper so it's easier to put on back is very showy it's more showy than other it might be a little bit difficult to be hiding your bra here so we're gonna have to see how this works one also has adjustable straps and you can also tighten the front if you want i'm really excited to try this one on it's also really flowy and cute on the bottom quite wrinkly but that's okay because it went through shipping i don't know i got a lot of pieces in like mustard yellow i don't have a lot of clothes like that we are almost done this one is so cute they have this one in like red but i thought it was kind of like too much like a flamenco dancer i feel like it is a little bit thin and see-through it's definitely wrinkly so i need to get all those wrinkles out overall this dress i freaking love it's really comfortable it's a little bit short but for me i think it's actually kind of fine just kind of worried if like you're gonna show something maybe you don't get this um i think i'm okay though in the back for the most part it covers up my bra however i can still feel that like it's kind of showing but luckily the bow kind of just covers it so that's nice i really recommend buying this one because it's really cute 
and form-fitting. One thing I would say though is that you can see a little bit outline of my bra. There is like double fabric right here. You can see it's about two inches because they kind of just wrapped over the fabric. Well, obviously it doesn't go throughout the entire dress. So I can honestly really see it right now. I really like the cut on this. If you are thinking of purchasing this, I would maybe go for a darker color to avoid this from happening. Or maybe just wear a bandeau so that you cannot see the bra outline because I can see it pretty clearly and so can you. But this is a really cute dress. The next thing I got was one of like the staples. A few of their pieces have like over 999,000 reviews on them. And this was one of the pieces and it's also like five stars as well. And look at, this is so cute. Whoa. This one I just got in a small. Hopefully this will go around. This is just a plain white spaghetti strap crop top. The fabric on this one is actually really soft and smooth. This is also really stretchy. Straps, I'm gonna hope, are really durable. I like the quality on this one because it has the same fabric on the inside and the outside. And this type of material also wouldn't shrink, so that's also a good thing. Super cute though, and they have a lot of colors for this one. And this was only $4. Here's the top which I just paired with one of the other bottoms from the other set. This one is pretty good just for four dollars. The straps I would kind of like worry about a little bit. I mean they're thin straps anyways. This one is really cute. I would reorder this one as well. Soft material and it's not see-through at all. So the only downside is that it's kind of tight. It's not like this isn't my size. It's fitting and a medium would be a little bit too large I think. It would be too loose but this one is a bit too tight to the point where you can see my bra raw in the back like the outline of it so i would just have my hair cover this up honestly because it's not too great looking it's more obvious with the color white the darker colors i think it wouldn't show less oh no ignore my red chest <laughs> okay the last piece that we have and then we're gonna get onto the bathing suits this one isn't a dress it's actually a romper this is kind of just a light yellow floral romper it also has adjustable straps it goes quite low so we'll have to see if your bra will work out with this as well the waistband also scrunches and it's very stretchy holy crap and it also comes with something that you can tie around your waist so that it'll look smaller. I would expect that these two would come together like the other one. It, they came separately, but I guess it's better this way. Just make sure you don't lose this uh, or it doesn't get like tangled in the laundry. From the looks of it though, it looks like it's going to be kind of long. I'm not really sure though. Okay. This one is actually super cute. The thing about these dresses though is that I just really am not a fan of this tiny little string holding the thing like it's better off just without it honestly so you can honestly just cut it off and it's gonna sit here anyways and you tied it so in order for my bra not to be showing so much I need to tighten it more a little bit but I kind of want like a looser kind of feel for it just make sure that when you're putting on this little tie thing that you're covering up the little cinch waist right here because it's not gonna look too great it looks better if you just like cover it up but yeah I'm pretty happy with with this one as well this one is actually a little bit loose on the arms which is okay because it's like a baggy kind of feel on the back you can kind of like see that it's loose a little bit of a con but it's still wearable you could easily just hide it with your hair or something moving on to the bathing suits now for the bathing suits they put it in different packaging so in total i got four bathing suits and they all come in this cute packaging well actually except for one it just came in a plastic bag but i think for all of these i got a size small for the bathing suits it only runs from small to large you can't really go like extra small or anything like some of the clothing pieces that they have first bathing suit that i'm going to show you it actually came separately you have to like buy the pieces separately here are the bottoms these are kind of just like a purpley burgundy-ish these are like high-waisted bottoms or at least i'm hoping that they're high-waisted bottoms and on the sides it's kind of showy and strappy over here quality on these are pretty good they're nice and stretchy i haven't had a piece that looks like this like a style like this before for a bathing suit i also purchased is the matching top which i think is a tube top this also has padding in it I prefer that this would be smaller i guess because tube tops you know tend to ride up whenever you're swimming this also has removable padding something i would say about this is that they're a little bit off in color the tube top is a little lighter than the bottoms i appreciate that the fabric is the same all around and it's not like white on the inside because the white kind of peeps through sometimes one of the downsides of this is i can see the red go straight through here it doesn't seem too secure or high quality and they didn't even cut it all the way so i'm gonna have to cut that but i'm glad that this does have padding as expected this is not tight enough i could feel 
eyelid just so loose so i can only use this for lounging really at least that has padding though the tie on the side is really nice it's really not hard to get this on honestly and i don't think that you have to untie it and retie it every single time that you wear this kind of not completely covering my belly button but if i kind of just tuck it up a little bit if i move it's gonna show again but i think it's pretty good kind of unfortunate that these are two different colors but it's not too big of a drastic change or difference the back is also nice and cheeky but not too much this one's a good purchase as well just be cautious on the top however i do have smaller boobs so next case is this straight up yellow bathing suit that i got i got all sets because it's just better that way here are the bottoms it has like nice knots on the sides this one also has the same material all around it's kind of like a knit kind of pattern it looks really yellow these are definitely a little bit more cheekier than like some of the swimsuits you would normally see and here is the bathing suit top it's the same exact thing this one also has padding in the picture i will say that it looked a little bit bigger plus the model that was wearing this also seemed like she had like bigger breasts i would say that this kind of looks a little bit small i i would expect that it would cover a little bit more but we'll have to see there are also metal clasps in the back very similar to like zaffle swimsuits this is also like a halter swimsuit so you can tie it around your neck so it'll also support your boobs a little bit more so yeah there's that swimsuit this one's got quite a few problems with it the top here you can really see the pad outlining it's just like huge circles very not attractive so what i have to do is take them out honestly and honestly my boobs just aren't that big so it's just not looking too great but i'm not really a fan of this cut i wish it would kind of be like over here and up rather than right here in the center come in a little bit more i thought it would be a little bit more supporting the size is pretty good i just don't like the padding it really does not look too great like you can literally see the outline it's just too thick because these are removable you can get another padding and replace them i don't know i think i expected this one to be a little bit better though you can literally see the padding right here looks so bad we have two more swimsuits to check the next one is also kind of a mustard yellow this one i actually ordered in a medium because i think i read the reviews that the bottoms were a little bit too small but honestly i probably should have stayed with the small this one at least has soft fabric on the outside because the outside is kind of like this knit kind of type fabric it's kind of like a rough but on the inside it's nice and soft this has removable padding as well but for this one you can't adjust the straps or the band this looks too big on me that's also a con for purchasing sets can't select the size for the top and the bottom if i were to wear this i think i could only lounge in it and here are the matching bottoms as well i should have gotten a small i thought that this one was really cute because of the ruffles on the bottom this one is actually cute this is the only medium item that i have purchased ignore my redness by the way i my skin gets easily irritated i honestly could have gotten a small with this one this is still wearable but honestly I'd rather have a small. This one is pretty good. I would actually really recommend this one. Pretty good coverage all around and it's just really cute. And now the last piece that I ordered is this red swimsuit. This is the only one that has the white lining on the inside. The models on all of the pictures look really good. This might look like trash on me. These do not have adjustable straps, but they do have padding in it, removal of a padding as well. But yeah, this also has metal clasp on the back as well. Hopefully the white's not gonna peek through. It low-key kind of looks really small, but I have small boobs anyway so it's fine the downside is that this i'm definitely gonna have to cut this part off like man the downside is that the front is way too small like who would for my fingers no way is this gonna cover anything i genuinely thought that the back was the front because it covers a little bit more and then the back would just be really like thong like but no it's the other way around and i don't think i could ever wear this or this red bathing suit i I kind of look funny but that's fine i am definitely not going to be trying this on because there is no way that this is going to cover anything anything there is just no way so i'd have to use a different red bathing bottom which i do have so that's good and this one is pretty spot on because the straps are tight even though you can't adjust them they're pretty good size this one's really cute and even if i have small boobs it's really supportive as well and i actually really like this one although there is white lining it's tight enough for it to not really show because if it weren't tight then it would kind of like poke out a little bit this one was really cheap too but um i'm actually confident that this would stay on inside the pool not that anyone really uses swimsuits for swimming anymore it's really just for pictures and tiktok but you know what i actually go swimming so i really love this one so those are all the pieces that i have to show you guys i hope that you found this video somewhat helpful in your decision making process if you are going to brace yourself with sheen all in all i would say that all the sizes are true to size for the most part what i did was stick to the smalls but just make sure that you're looking 
the waist size that's what i normally looked for i just looked for 26 and that worked out perfectly for me a lot of those were a perfect fit except for that one plaid skirt that was crunching up too much so that just wasn't tight enough and that one was just kind of all over the place in general but yeah for the most part i actually am happy with my purchases let me know what you guys think of them as well but with all that being said thank you guys for watching my video and i'll see you guys next time Everyone's planning up to see us